If you guys want to win more games, get innovative plays and updated game metas, then visit trythisplay.com and use code NOBLE at checkout for 10% off your purchases. Link is in the description. He is Pitt Cooper. Off to the races for the touchdown. What's up today, my fellow Madden soldiers? So, we got so much going on right now. We're going to update the Dallas Cowboy theme team. We're going to have five new additions to the Dallas Cowboy theme team. I don't even know what to say. Um, this is the first time that I can say I encounter this when it comes to Madden, especially Madden 21. Actually getting five new Dallas Cowboy players all at once. I'm pretty sure other theme teams got you know, more than one uh, card for their team. But yeah. This is unheard of, especially for the Dallas Cowboys um, when it comes to the theme team. So I'm very excited. The only thing was, was this. Initially, when they came out, I didn't have a lot of coins. Like, I didn't. Like, I had to really, really think on how about, how I'm going to go about getting these coins. So, because I knew that I needed to get these players on the squad. Because I was like, I, I like I said, I didn't anticipate this much Cowboys to come out. I figured, okay, they already came out with all the Cowboys going to come out with. Um already I, I figured it may be around christmas or something like that there'll be more cowboys coming out um but no they they released all at once so anyways long story short what i did was i sold tyreek hill that gave me about 600k coins and i already had over like I think 200k on top of that so anyways that gave me the ability to buy all the five new new additions to the dallas cowboys i haven't got demarcus Ware yet i could get him right now i'm undecided if i want to buy his card or if I want to buy his power up because as you can tell I only got 254k right so do I want to spend that on a power up or do I want to spend that on his card because like I said I really don't want to spend 200k 150k for a power up if I have to I will but I mean I can get his power up and then use a power up pass but I could just get this card the only thing that that would do was give me just plus one of everything so I might just go ahead and get his card but for right now we do got the campus heroes um we have four we got all four of them we got Herschel Walker, we got Pat Watkins, we got uh, Ken Norton, and we got Keyshawn Johnson. So for those, to, for, so these are all the Cowboys that they released, and I'm gonna show you right now. They get the Cowboy Kims, they get everything right. And for those who are curious, I will post on my uh, my YouTube community uh, post where where I usually post you know pictures and let you guys know who's new to the game. I will post all the all the players and and every team Kim that they get right. So anyways. Because Herschel Walker's first, we'll go ahead and start. Oh, no, let's just start off with Keyshawn Johnson, just based on the fact that um, apparently it don't show he gets Cowboy Kims, but you also see they don't also have no no Kims at all. So that that with that being said, that means they're gonna be able to get all the team Kims. So let's go to upgrades. So okay, let me counter. Okay, we we'll go here. Um. Oh, except okay, I was like, what? Okay, so anyways, we're gonna add all. We're gonna open up all the slots because what I'm gonna do for you guys. Like I said, it's gonna be it's gonna be a little bit of a long video, but I'm pretty sure everybody's gonna want to see everything when it comes to these abilities and everything else when it comes to these players. So I'm gonna do it because I know I would want to see it. So I'm gonna go over everything. So if you guys are curious, like you guys want to see a specific player that I'm showing you, then just go through the video and find it. But like I said, I'm gonna go through them all right now. Um, so these are his ability. I mean, his X factors. He gets double me rack them up i'm gonna go through i'm gonna go through real fast you know what i mean you can go back and look at them but this is what he gets right here um first tier abilities this is what he's gonna get right here just so you guys know um i'm not gonna name them all i'm just gonna show you guys them and like i said if you guys want to go back and look at them go ahead um but these are all the things that he all the, this is second tier abilities this is what he's getting right here so you can basically see um third tier abilities um where where, where are we at okay, okay, here we go so this is what he's getting route technician closer so um i don't see nothing extravagant uh you know it just looks like all similar abilities um but the thing is is look at his team kim just so you guys know showing you here he has jets kim tampa bay buccaneers cowboys which we're gonna put in against carolina panthers all right Keyshawn johnson i had him i think on madden 19 i think that's when he came i don't know if he was in here last year i can't remember i don't think he was but man 19 he was and i do got, got a dallas cowboy team on madden 19 and i have him on my squad i think he had he's a 99 overall on there but anyways so you see what there that he get they get all the team cams any any team cam that they play for um we're also going to put go deep on them times three so i'll go ahead and add that to him 
real quick. All right. And he gets Sprinter, uh, whatever else, you know, Acrobat, whatever. I'm going to put Sprinter on him, of course. Hopefully, with all these players, I should be able to have 40 out of 40 physical Kims as well as, you know, I already have the Dallas Cowboy Kim, so they should just add to it. So, it's going to be great. So, there he is right there. Let's go ahead and look at his attributes. Um, you know what? Um... I'm going to back because these are his attributes. He gets 88 speed, 89 jump, but I'm not going to go through this with all of them. What I'm going to do is I'm going to wait till I put him into the lineup and then we'll go over his attributes because you guys are going to want to see how he's looking in Dallas Cowboy lineup. So I don't want to um, go over right now because I'm going to go over them again. So let's go ahead and just go to upgrade. We're going to upgrade them real quick. This one I was already starting because I want to see if they got the, you know, the cams, which I was pretty confident they did because, you know. They don't have no team cam on them. Usually when a car has no team cam on him, that means that they get all the team cams. That's usually what that means. So here's his X Factor real quick, just so you guys are wondering. First tier abilities, let's go ahead and go through it. And he's a right outside linebacker, which we actually got one in DeMarcus Ware recently, which he's a goon too. So it's cool, because I'm pretty sure um, he might be able to get two different tiers or whatever. I mean, two different uh, abilities or, wh or whatever the case may be The changes. uh Position, positional change. We'll see right now, but whatever the case may be, we'll go ahead and change them around and put them where, where, where we could use them at. So this is second tier abilities. If you guys are wondering, once again, um, third tier abilities. This is what he gets right here. Like I said, if you guys want to go back and look at them, go ahead. But I'm not gonna name because I got so many players. I'm not gonna name every single thing off like I usually do um, because I got so many, you know. But I want to, I, I, but I still want to show you guys just in case you guys are curious it looked like he's gonna get two positions because he got the four slot down there so he played for the cowboys he was originally drafted by the cowboys and went uh, apparently to the 49ers uh and i think he won three super bowls um with with these two different teams but anyways uh there it is there we'll go ahead and add the cowboy kim on him so we're gonna put lockdown on him he gets times three so we'll put times three on him so we got that then we're gonna put sprinter of course, which I'm excited for. Yeah, this is a lot of Cowboys. And look at, he gets middle linebacker as well as well as left outside linebacker. So now I'm not gonna put him on on, on him right now. You know, eventually I probably I probably will. So he'll be able to fit in any of those positions. But I want to see how his overall changes once I do, and I'll show you guys that right now too. So there it is. There, if you guys are wondering what team did he play for in the Kims and abilities and everything else. So there it is. There. Um, now we're going to go to Pat Watkins, our free safety, which I'm hoping to see. So he gets four, uh, chemistries and positions or, you know, he has another slot. So I'm assuming he could change his, uh, team cam. So I'll probably put him at strong safety, but we'll see how he looks there. Whoever's more effective at strong safety, him or Cliff Harris. That's what we're going to put, um, in that position. So we'll be good. Oh, this guy should get the strong safety position. I'm assuming. So we'll probably end up putting him there if he gets that ability. So anyways, here we go. These are all his X factors. If you guys are wondering, first tier abilities, here we go. He doesn't get that much. Second tier abilities. I want the main thing you, some of you guys might want to see, like, you know, Acrobat, if you can see Enforcer. You know, some people still might want to put Enforcer. I'm not going to before I would have been excited about it. But at this time, I'm not going to. Um, but yeah, it looks like he got some decent stuff on him. Yeah, he got a lot. Um, Oh, and by the way, just so you guys know, this guy's six five, dude. If I if I'm if I could think right, uh, he's the, probably the tallest safety in the game right now. So that's another big plus. Oh, that was the third, third tier abilities. Okay, so we're done with that. So he also played. He played for the Cowboys as well as the Chargers. So shout out to Ki Kiwi filmmaker. I'm pretty sure he's happy about that. Lockdown times three. Now we're gonna go ahead and put Sprinter on him, and then see his positions. So he does get strong safety. Most likely, I'm gonna go ahead and just buy it right now because I don't think Cliff Harris actually get the strong get, gets the strong safety uh, Kim on him. So if he don't, then I'm gonna go ahead and uh, add Pat Watkins to the strong safety position. So I'm gonna add that automatically because I already know. That most likely that's where I'm gonna put him. So now let's go to Herschel Walker. Let's go to his upgrades. We go ahead and uh, I know this is like going to be a big one. Besides, the, like I said, the safety and the and the ha um, halfback. Most likely, these are the these are the people that you're gonna want to see the abilities that they have. Cause you know, but they might you might want to know if they get evasive and stuff stuff like that. So we're gonna check all that right now. 
Um, so this are his X factors. Um, I really ain't tripping on X factors. The ability is what is what matters because these are the ones that you know activate as soon as the game starts. You can't really take them away. So, so I guess he gets bulldozer, right? Uh, they're not really looking that good, actually. Bruiser, he gets bruiser. Uh, so apparently he, he don't get no. Wow. So he doesn't get like jukebox or evasive or anything. Does he get evasive at all? Like at any time? No. It don't look like he he be he don't it don't even look like he'll be able to get it. Breaks his stick tackles. There's a few people in game to get it. So there it is for all the but he don't get that much abilities. It's fine. I don't plan to put him on him any uh, on him anyway. Seriously, I think they play just fine without him. Honestly, for some reason this year Madden, I'm fine with uh yeah. I didn't know he played for this much teams though. So he played for the Cowboys, uh, Minnesota Vikings, and Philadelphia Eagles apparently, and then uh, New York Giants. So apparently he played for every team in the NFC East besides Washington. So we'll go ahead and put Cowboys. That I didn't know. But I'm pretty sure he started off with the Cowboys though. If I, uh, if I remember right, we're gonna put go deep for now. Later on, we might work on some uh, zone run. But right now, putting go deep on everyone, and then we put. So he don't have no secondary positions, or I probably would have used him as like a fullback if he got like a fullback position, because we could use him. I mean, we could still put him as fullback, but you know, to, just to know that he actually had it, that would actually be good. So what am I looking at? Oh, go deep. Oh, oh, yeah, because I don't have the Cowboy team activated. That's why. So that's not my Cowboy theme team activated. That's what I want to see. So anyways, it's back out. We have one more player we got to go get. Let's go ahead and go get him. Um, I'm going to see how much DeMarcus Ware is power up is going for. If he's not going for that much, we'll go sw we'll swoop it up. But if he is, then we're just going to have to uh, just buy this regular player. It's fine. We're going to put uh, Ware. No, nah, we're not even going to put Ware. Let me go back out. We're going to put a uh, left outside linebacker. put Cowboys and no, all you know it's right outside linebacker I don't know why I put left outside linebacker I get them confused all right let's put right outside all right oh so he's already right here so apparently yeah so it's still 195 we could afford it and then you know we got enough training to fully power him up but uh I rather at this moment I rather just get his card so I'm gonna go ahead and buy it for 146 or 149. We'll go ahead and get that, and then later on we'll get the power up because right now I think it'll, it'll be way more better. Because at least we have his car. We'll go ahead and we'll, we'll look at his abilities and everything he gets. Okay, so apparently went to you know before you'll be able to you know back out and then it'll pop up. Now you, I don't know what's going on, but apparently they're going back in the item binder after this new uh, update they had. So we gotta go power them back up. Let's power. We'll power them up, and then we'll add everybody to the lineup. Yeah, I was I was very happy to demark. I know you I, you guys want to see a video sooner, but I'm glad I waited because we got new players. But like I said, I was very happy that Demarcus work came in the game. He wasn't in last year. He came in this year. So excited about that. It looks like they're doing a lot more for the theme teams this year, and I'm happy about that because a lot of people, you know, that's what they play for. They like other players from other teams too, but they also like their their team that they represent. So here's here's uh, X factors. Here's all his X factors that he gets. First tier abilities. Yeah, I would assume he'll get a lot more because you know he is a goon. A lot of people know that, and he's fast. He is fast. Let me tell you. So this is what he's getting out of his abilities. Second, these are second tier abilities. So as you can tell, like he's getting a lot of stuff on a second tier. Third tier, he should get even more. Yeah, I see. Whole lot more. Like he even gets enforcer. Wow. Even though I'm not using it, it's still good to know that you got it. Because you never know that one day they might pop up and be like, hey, the forcer is just doing doing what it's supposed to now. And then, bam, your player gets it. That's why, I, even though I'm not using it, I'm just happy to know that we're able to, uh, yeah, we're able to basically use it if we ever want it. So he gets Cowboy Kim. Apparently, that's what he has. We had his power up. He was, oh, we can't change it. In order, I'm not worried about it because he, he, he has Cowboy Kim. But if you if you wanted to change it to the Bronco Kim because he played for the Broncos too, I think his last couple of years, whatever the case may be, um, you have to have the power up. So for those who are deciding whether they should get the Carter power up, get the power up if you want to put the Bronco Kim on him because that's all he's getting right now. He's only getting Cowboy Kim if you don't have the power up. 
So let's go ahead and put Sprinter on him. I'm eagerly, uh, I eagerly want to know if I'm going to get the 40 out of 40 Sprinter cam, right? Because that with there will give the whole squad plus four speed. Think about it. Two from having uh, 50 out of 50 components of, of the Cowboy cam and then two more for having maxed out Sprinter. So now let's go over here, change lineup. We're gonna go ahead and put uh, Dallas Cowboys. All right, so we got Herschel Walker. He's gonna be our number one now. We'll start adding them. Uh, there we go. Substitute the whole depth chart. So I'm gonna put Zeke in. I, I, I gotta I gotta make sure I put all the adjustments because we want to see if the sprint and everything gets maxed out. Most of you guys will probably say yes or something because you guys probably already did it, um, but I haven't done it yet. So for those who are curious, you know you have different people tuning. Those who probably have a goon uh, squad gooned out already, and those who don't and still are, are wanting to know. So I'm gonna answer all as much as I can. I'm gonna answer as much of your uh, guys' questions as I can through this video. That's why it's gonna be a little bit lengthy, but it's fine though. Because I know you guys are going to want to know. Where's uh Pollard? Here he is. So we got Keyshawn Johnson too. CD Lamb. So I'm going to put uh, Keyshawn Johnson right here as our fourth. It really don't matter. The thing is, is that he's going to be in. He gets Cowboy Kim and he got Sprinter. So it's fine. I'll move him around later. But in the end, he's not as fast as the other receivers. But... What I like about, about it is like he's a cowboy. He gets a cowboy cam and he gets sprinter and everything else on him. See, if they would have got power-ups, that would have been even better because we would have we been able to get times two sprinter. And hopefully, like, let me, let me see the sprinter how it's looking right now. Um, Sprinter. So, oh, yeah. So, we'll be able to have four. Oh, whoa. We're going to be able to have 40 out of 40 after this because we really got. Okay, so we're, we're on the right path already. Um, You see, we got Damian Wilson. So, now we got way more now. Now I could put Demarcus Ware right there. All right, there we go. Straight goon status. Um, Robert Quinn, I will leave him there for now. Oh, so they fit. Oh, I just know. I just noticed something. They fixed the actual middle linebacker thing. Cause remember, it was actually blank for a while. So at least they got that right. Um, what am I gonna do? So I can see I got Cliff here. So. Hold on, so Cliff Harris, let's let's, cl let's click on him real quick. Because remember, we're all curious of if he got the... Oh, he does. So why do I still have him as... Yeah, that doesn't make sense for me. Okay, so I want to see who's, who, whose overall is higher at the... So let's go over here real quick. Let's go back right here. I want to see. So he'll be at 89, so that's not gonna, much going to change. So... It's fine. So I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep him at right here. I'm gonna change him out. That's how we're gonna do this. So I'm gonna put Pat Watkins right here as free safety, and then I'm gonna put. Let's go back here. So he, ooh, he's a 95. Wow. See, I don't have to keep Cliff Harris out there because he's already strong safety. So that's good. That's his other position. So that's good. But I'm gonna put Xavier Woods as our second. No, no just position only. Yeah, or well, as our backup right there. So we should have maxed out Sprinter now with that being said. So a lot of people should eat probably even go more. See? Where's Sprinter? Nope, we got one more. One more and I'll max him out, which we'll do that right now. So, okay, so we're going to put... Okay, let's see if let's see how he's looking with his right outside line. Um, let's see how he's looking right here. Okay, so he actually keeps his overall. Wow. So that's what exactly we're gonna put him at, and I'm gonna to make sure he keeps his Kims and all that stuff because you know they're gonna max, they're gonna cross it out. I'm gonna go ahead and put him as right outside linebacker. At least we know that he keeps his Kims. Here we go. So I mean left outside linebacker. I'm sorry. So we know that now. And just to add, I'm gonna put both of them because when you put both of them, that means that if you move them around, oh no, hold on, hold on, whoa, 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 whoa. let's go ahead and uh, replace it. So it's already paid for. It's just if we ever have to replace it in the future, if we get another right outside linebacker or left outside linebacker, we can. So it's already been bought. So there he is there. We should have maxed out Sprinter now. No, we don't. Why is that? Oh, okay. I got it now. Because we got to put. No. Ooh. 
So hold on, we we gotta really work on this right now. So okay, so this is what I'm gonna do. No, because mm, I'm gonna have to put him as middle linebacker. I'm gonna have to put that's good. It's good though. Ken or it's it's still good. I can still interchange him. That's not the problem. But is anyone else in here that I have to change? Did I get anyone else? So we got those two. DeMarcus Ware. So that's one, two, three, four, four, five. We got those ready. Okay, so that's what I'm going to do. You guys seen it right here in motion. So in order, in order for us to get the max style sprinter, this is what we're going to have to do. We're going to put him as middle linebacker. All right. So it's, it's right. He's it's crossed out. And I'm going to put... I'm going to put... Um, Yeah, Malcolm Smith back in. That's fine. He does a good job. That's that's fine. I'm fine with that because he was a he don't get cowboy Kim, but he was a cowboy before, so that's fine. And then we're gonna put put him right here as middle linebacker number two. Uh, he's only gonna be at 89 at that position, but it's fine though. It is what it is. Now we're a 91 overall for getting it right. Then I gotta put where is he at? Okay, no, no, no. Anthony Hitchens back. So there it is there. I got to keep Robert Quinn in because he gets... Oh, you know what? I, I, I don't have to keep Robert... Because we have the 50 out of 50 Cowboy components, right? So we have 55 out of 50 now. Okay, so I can work on the other stuff later. But right now, as you can tell, we actually got maxed out Sprinter. So that means we... Anybody who's on this squad, as you can tell, even Trayvon Diggs went up. We get times four speed now. Like everybody's getting times four speed. Whatever they had, times four speed, just so you guys know. So let's go ahead now and look at the abilities. I mean, look at their attributes. So here's Herschel Walker. <laughs> wow. Look at how he's looking now on the Dallas Cowboy team. 96 speed, 97 acceleration, 90 agility, 90 carry, 67 uh, catching, 90 change of direction, 90 truck. 80 uh what's that i don't know what that is um any six one wow 96 speed because we're able to maneuver around fix up the cams i'm still gonna fix up a little bit more but that's how it's looking right there Keyshawn johnson on the dallas cowboy theme team let's see how he's looking attributes 92 speed he's not too fast he's never really been too fast it is what it is but he's more good for his you know catching his catching stats and stuff so we got 92 jump 94 catching 92 catching traffic uh 93 spectacular 92 short route 90 medium route and 90 deep route so now let's go to our defense now all right so we'll start off with uh demarcus Ware. I guess should I should have went to the free safety, but it's fine. Um, let's see how he's looking. So look at Demarcus. If we powered him up, he go to 94 speed. But without the power up, he's going to 93 speed, 94 acceleration, 91 strength, 93 tackle, 97 play rec, 89 block shit, 89 power um, power move, 89 finesse move. But like I said, all those 89s are going to go to 90 once we power them up. So remember that all those will go to 90. So now let's go to Pat Watkins. Like I told you guys, this is going to be a lengthy video because I'm going to go through everything because I want you guys to see what they're able to get because I know you guys are going to have questions. So Pat Watkins come in at 95 speed, 96 acceleration, 94 tackle, 93 play rick, um, 90 man coverage, 95 zone coverage, 86 hit power. Wow. His coverage. Is, look at this. Look how high. Look how tall he is. 6'5". Oh my goodness. It's going to be... Oh... I'm pretty sure be, be, even besides Cowboy fans, other people are going to pick this guy up because of his height. Guarantee that. So now let's check out uh, Norton. Ken Norton. Attributes. So he got 90 speed, 93 acceleration, 85 strength, 97 tackle, 96 play rec, 88 block shit. So it's power move, finesse move, and all that. But it's fine though, right? And he comes in at 6'2 because... He's more as a coverage linebacker anyway, and that's what we need, and he's fast. So we got so many fast players now on the Cowboy squad, thanks to the 4-plus speed, man. It's going to oh, man. This this squad is going to be insane now, right? Plus 4 speed on everyone, right? So let's see how Trayvon digs, right? Because he's, you know, he's like a lower, 
overall. He's at 84. He bounced up four overalls. He bounced up four overalls. Now he got 90 speed. Remember, he's only at 84. So imagine when he gets upgrades later on. So this squad is looking a whole lot better. Um, I will give you guys. Uh, I, I want to do the gameplays just so you guys know. How you guys are like, oh, I know you've been saying that. Look, I done a gameplay for you guys, but I know you guys ain't gonna want to see it because of of the, all the five new cards. So I'm gonna have to delete that gameplay and do another one for you guys. Like I'm glad that I'm glad I didn't even start the editing process because it would have been horrible. Because you guys ain't gonna want you ain't gonna want to see it. Considering that we have five new players, you're gonna want to see this one. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this one and then get it done because no one would have expected us to get five new players that fast. So now that we do, it's cool. Our squad is looking good. Um, our offense and defense is looking good. Like I'm 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 alright with it. If we end the year with what we have right here. I'm happy. So the only thing I know the year the year ain't ended. So I know it's only going. Basically, what I'm trying to say it's only going up for here. We got our we both got our free safety, our strong like we got everybody we asked for. Pretty sure there's a few more other people. Like I said, so if we got this much already, you can only you can only figure that it's gonna get even better from here, man. Like we got some decent players on this squad. I'm loving it. I know you guys are loving it. Like I said, be prepared for that gameplay. And uh, I, I want to do another update soon after the gameplay, and I want to go over all the other stats for you guys on the squad just because you know um there's more kims and abilities that i did i want to show you guys how i did it but anyways i'm gonna leave it right here i really hope you guys enjoyed the bit video if you guys did drop a like if you guys didn't sub sub to the channel there will be more great amazing content coming your way thank you guys all for tuning in i'm out